but a few tips to leave you. I jotted down 10 that are just, just quick tips that I, that I thought would be useful. Is one, be truly open. And that's be open to the stuff you, 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 you don't know you need to change as much as the stuff you do know you need to change. And keep the eyes open and always keep the ears open. You can learn from everybody. Build a culture willing to change because it's very difficult to do it on your own. Never stop exploring and evolving, right? Businesses in my mind can go in two directions. You can have a business that's growing or a business in decline. You can't have a business standing still. And it's the people who think they can stand still, get comfortable, but really they end up going backwards ultimately. Listen more and listen better. And this is one close to my heart. I have been working on this over the last couple of years and not just the concept of listening, but also always hearing what is being said and whether it's being said with words or whether it's being said with body language. Get help and advice, <laughs> multiple mentors and coaches. That's come up again and again. Remember, you are the only one person. And that lovely expression that is, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. So make sure you bring people with you. And in that regard, from an alignment perspective, as a leader, as a manager, as a founder, it is your job. And you have to take that job and that responsibility of alignment very seriously, right? People can get lost on the journey and it's not often their fault. It's often your fault. So we got to take that responsibility as founders and leaders. Bring your people with you. And it came up again and again in that last session, the importance of gut, right? We must. We have three uh, important things in our body from an entrepreneurship. It's the brain, it's the heart, and it's the gut. And the gut is the thing, how do I feel? And we have to trust it. That is our main frame as entrepreneurs. And just to finish up on the last point, I would like to say it is hard, as Johnny said, and it can get harder, right? And you do need to mind yourself. And as Portrick said, you need to go easy on yourself. And as Evian said, you need to be kind to yourself and others at these challenging times. So I hope this event has been a benefit to you. Thanks for being part of it.